a nice glass of ice cold beer. Behind every pour, there's a process. You're not measuring alcohol. We're in bio 382. You're measuring the difference in sugar. Fermentation sciences, where students are learning how to make beer. Attenuation is simply how well the yeast took all the sugar to alcohol. Class is taught at Lyon College, a small liberal arts school in Batesville, Arkansas, a little more than two hours outside of Memphis. The hands-on course is unique. Take 100 or 80. It's fun. And it's like different than anything else I could get to take at most schools. Staff here says Lyon is the first small liberal arts school in the state to offer this kind of class. That's good. You can see for yourself the class size is very small. This is the first year it's been offered. And I was looking uh, for some way to increase uh, STEM. Dr. Alexander Beezer, who created this specific class for Lyon, is the professor. His goal, get more students interested in science. If you can find something that students already have an interest in and then use that as a hook. If I can get students say, I want to take this class as opposed to I have to take this class, I, I think that it just makes for a better class. Because those are done fermenting, I'm going to put them into uh, a cold room. Brewing beer for credit isn't the only unique circumstance. The college also sits in a dry county. So dry county means you can't commercially sell liquor. But Beezer says there's nothing wrong with making your own beer and the students aren't selling the finished product. There is, however, one big prerequisite. Students must be 21 years old to enroll, and... We do not drink anything. We don't consume anything in this laboratory. Even when cases when we could, we don't. Junior Tommy Maloney, who hopes to be a doctor someday, says this course has been eye-opening. It forces you to like expand your boundaries and learn something about, like, I didn't know anything going into it, but I've learned so much in just a couple of weeks that we've been in here. This is what we boil water. This is a mash tun, so this is where we put the grains and convert the starch into sugars. Learning not only science. So there's a little bit of history, uh, a little bit of anthropology, so we talk about the origins of beer. Along with what shapes people's preferences for the kind of beer they like, walking away with lessons, not just in beer. It's like, hey, beer is cool, and then when they leave, they leave with an appreciation of, you know, what the scientific method is. Just to know what, like, what's going on and what, like, processes are behind things and just to educate yourself further on, like, not just what you drink, but, like, anything. It could be, like, what you eat. So this is, like, a perfect example of, like, applying science to just, like, an everyday facet of your life. Shay Arthur, WREG, News Channel 3.